Hey y'all, um, this video serves as a little guide to people who are seeing animal totems continuously. And when I say animal totems, I mean you keep seeing the same uh, ladybug or you keep seeing the same bee or you keep seeing the same praying mantis. Um, this video is for if you see a praying mantis. I want to talk about what it means, okay? So I kept seeing praying mantises at my mom's house on her door. Um, and I'm just like, dang. And when I would tell her to go out to like find it, she didn't see it. So then I, my intuition was like, oh, that message was for me. So let me look up what it means like to see a praying mantis. So first of all, a praying mantis is absolutely a good luck charm. But first, let me let me back up. Let me just say, um, in Native American culture, the totem animal is a spiritual symbol. Um, it's a spirit guide's way of communicating with us. Um, it is believed that a spirit animal chooses you from the day you were born until you die. However, you can have different spirit animals at different times that are not meant to stay forever. They're just there for the message at that point in time in your life. So, if you see a praying mantis, again, it looks, it, it's, a, it's like a good luck charm. It's, it's spirit's way of telling you, don't worry, you have good fortune and good luck either around you, coming to you, um, or that's the power that you're harnessing. So, step into that. Like, if you know that you have a good luck charm, then walk like, walk as if you know that luck is surrounding you. If you see a praying mantis, you will have a good run of things or if you can look forward to some, or you can look forward to some good future and then some good fortune in the near future. It's also a symbol of peace, focus and concentration. Um, it shows if you if you take the opportunity, if there's an opportunity presented to you and you take it, good fortune will come from it, okay? It also shows that uh, good things come to those who wait because praying mantises can hold stationary for hours. It's pretty much like patience. Be patient, don't worry. Continue to do what you're doing, move forward, and good fortune will come to you. Spirit is assuring you that it's going to happen. Uh, praying mantises are green, so it uh, symbolizes nature and the reminder to reconnect with Mother Nature in order to attain inner peace, just if you feel frenzy. Because if it's reminding us that good luck is coming, then you could possibly be like anxious or antsy like your your monetary needs could be a little fluctuate fluctuating at this point or it could be a little funny so this is spirit's way of assuring you don't worry we got you the money's coming but make sure that you're moving with passion you have patience you show up consistently and diligently um and it's gonna happen and it also reminds us to persevere in order to in order to overcome our obstacles because you know it's it's hard this journey is hard. It's not always easy. But if you have perseverance, you will overcome it. Um, you know, so continue to have, like, do it with poise. Having poise and grace and precision. So don't don't move impulsively. Move with precision. Contemplate a deliberate um, plan to move forward, you know? Uh it could be a symbol of vision, having vision or the vision that you have will have great fortune. The prayers like that uh, that you may be praying will come to fruition. Just have patience. It's a sign to move with wise intention. Again, don't act impulsively, act with precision and deepen your mindfulness. Um, And this is also a creature that encourages us to slow down. Now, where we are right now, this is September 4th. And the, and the energy for September Virgo season is to slow down. 
I've been getting this message for forever and a day. So me seeing that praying mantis was right on point with that. Uh, so it encourages us to slow down and connect with our inner wisdom. Um, a praying mantis is a highly spiritual uh, insect or animal or whatever it is. <laughs> Uh, and it could also just be telling you that you're sharpening your clairvoyant abilities, you know. But for sure, it's telling us to tap into stillness, connect to our spiritual realms, answer the call to our soul, slow down, surrender whatever you're seeking, whatever problem you have, whatever obstacles is going on around you, whatever questions you have, surrender that to the universe, to God mother nature and all will be well you know just release let it go release and ask life for the solution you know that serves the highest good for everyone and ask for it to be rebuilt um it is also a sign to engage in prayer more when you see um praying mantises it's a sign for you to pray more surrender to the divine it's time to get more into your holiness, you know, at that point in time. So, if you happen to keep seeing a praying mantis, that is a very good sign for you, my love. And I hope that you can look it up and you take heed and you apply it to your life. And we will begin to be able to flow with life. This is another way to flow with life. Um, the universe is so awesome. And it allows us to have these little messages and these little uh, uh, directions, if you will. These animals gives us direction, if you will. Um, and I think we're very blessed to have that. And I am so grateful to be able to see that. So if you see it. Baby, you in your spiritual bag and thank God and the universe for these messages to you and apply them. Don't forget to apply them. So again, if you see a praying mantis, baby, celebrate because good fortune is coming, but be patient and endure the hard times that you're going through because whatever your, whatever your vision is, it's, come, it's going to come to fruition. It's going to come. The money's coming, honey. Align yourself to the energy. Be still. Don't chase nothing. It's all about the inner work. We're doing the inner work right now, okay? I love you. And hopefully this message reaches who it does. And there will be more to come. Bye. <laughs>